I want to welcome you to a day out with Dr. Hassan Batts. My name is Dr. Hassan Batts. I am a community epidemiologist. I'm a community-based participatory researcher. I'm a prison survivor, and I'm someone that enters this work as a context and a content expert because I stand on the lived experience that I have. I work across this globe uh, with communities, with organizations, and with institutions and lifting up the voices of community because most often community voices are ignored and we hold intimate solutions to the problems that exist. Hello. Hello, are you Hassan? Yes, ma'am. Nice to meet you. I'm Chris. Um, Chris I work at the Office of Life. Pleasure to meet you too. So thank you so much for coming. Yeah, We're thank so you excited. for having me. So um, if you want to come in this way, just like I feel like we're time. late. I have. No, you're 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 on perfect time. Wow. So you know, in a box, of course. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah, after yes, the love that she shows to the community, man, is is unmatched across this valley. So, so shout out to you, sister. Yeah. It's not just something we hold in the heart, right? It's something that we share, that we that we share from the tongue, and it's the ways in which we show up every day. So when we say we love black people. How do we show up and love black people? And this is to the black people in the room and also to the white folks that call themselves allies. Is how do we show up, right? Dr. Francis Cress Wilson said that black love is a revolutionary act. She said that black love is a revolutionary act. And what does that mean? It goes back to the time when black love was illegal. It was illegal. I couldn't love my wife in this country not too long ago, right? They claimed us as property, man. And I'm not here to talk doom and gloom, right? We're talking about this idea of the rebellion, the resistance, and the revolution that exists inside of us. From long before these people showed up, from long before those boats showed up, man, we were fighting for this idea of love. We were fighting for this idea of legacy. And when you're on this campus, and when you, when you step off of this campus, you have to understand that programs, policies, practices, always reflect the values of the people that design them. Uh, when you're looking just at diversity, equity, inclusion, you can use like a quota system, we can just check some boxes, but belonging is about shared accountability, it's about feedback, it's about uh, the user experience and making sure whether we're talking about students, patients, professionals, or community members. Are, are in spaces where they can thrive because there's authentic relationships.